Hello Aries, it's my lady from my lady's way tarot and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of October 21st, no 24th through the 31st, 2022. The cards I'm using today are Oracle of Visions by Kiro Marchetti. Express readings again, okay? Um, and I'm closing off with um, Sacred Traveler Oracle Cards by Denise Lynn, okay, so you gotta I gotta read those so I'm only gonna pull one Okay, if I feel like we need more I'll pull two But I want to thank everybody for like sharing subscribing and setting up personal readings with me All right more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right. What's going on with the Aries? Aries 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 What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right. So we have card number 14 reverse here. So this makes me feel like somebody has quite a bit on their mind. And I do feel like somebody is um, maybe getting ready to do something to block it off. Um, or like the problem is gone. Okay, problem is gone. I'm not worried about it anymore. Okay. All right, so we got card number three here. So I do feel like somebody's getting ready to drop everything behind and move forward. Yeah, that'll get a lot of stuff off your mind there. Okay. Okay. All right, yep, letting go. So I do feel like somebody is starting to realize that whatever this thing is going on in their relationship, um, they can't control it. They can't stop it. They can't help it. They can't fix it. So you got to let it go. Okay, that's what somebody is feeling here. It's like there's nothing I can do to fix this. So I just got to let it be. All right. So we got card number 13 reverse. So I feel like um, you're in a situation where you were being controlled by someone. Somebody was being very controlling or could have been a total opposite. It's like somebody's being extremely careless to the point where it seems like you're controlling, but you're not. Okay. Uh, but it's just like, <sighs> this is so weird because I'm feeling the feeling of, I feel like somebody was doing stuff on purpose to try to get you to do things, okay? But you wasn't doing them. I feel like maybe at the beginning, but at the end, I feel like I don't want to, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it. And stuff just start piling up. Okay, stuff just start piling up, adding up. All right. Well, what happened here? Okay, so I believe this is going to be the card we're going to choose. But then we're going to see what the heck I just did with these cards. Because uh, I don't know what just happened. So, what the heck? This might... All right. <laughs> we're going to keep going. So, we got card number 44. So, I, um, I feel like somebody is tired of playing along. I'm tired of playing along. I'm trying to just tired of going along with the grain. This is not what I like to do. This is not what I want. I'm I'm just not okay. And that's the energy that I was getting at first. Uh, you know, I'm going along with it, and then I just feel like all of a sudden I just I I was just through. I'm through. I'm done. I'm not doing it. All right. Yep. So we got card number five here. So it looks like, of course, somebody's taking a leap of faith into something new. Like, I don't care what happens when I drop everything and move forward. I worry about it when I get there, but I just cannot do this. Okay. I just cannot do this any longer. All right. So, mm, of course. So, we got card number 27. So, I do feel like you're dealing with a very adventurous, a very attractive person. But I do feel like trouble just, just follow, this, follow this person. Okay? This person just linked to things that are no good. It's just like trap after trap. It's like, is it really worth dealing with this person if every time I turn around, I'm getting into something or got to pay for something? Okay? It's like it's always something. It's never just... 
let's go have some fun you know it's all it's some stuff like oh i gotta go pay this bill before they shut some stuff off okay that's the energy i'm feeling all right so we got card number four here so i do feel like i usually don't see it like this but i'm starting to feel like somebody's starting to see eye to eye with their um younger self like okay now i understand why i start acting like i was acting so this makes me feel like somebody may have been in a relationship and they got out of this relationship i feel like it was a long-term relationship and start dealing and dating new people dealing with or dating new people and now it's like okay now i see out why i was so mean okay or now i i see why i was so short or you know whatever the things that i was doing when i was younger now i realize why i was doing it i wasn't being mean i was just being direct like i'm not even about to play this game but this makes me feel like somebody was in a situation for a real long time before they got to this okay so let's see what's going on with the sacred traveler oracle cards all right, let's see what's going on with the Aries. Oh, they upside down. I saw it. Aries, Aries, Aries. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right. Oh, I put it upside down. All right, so tread thoughtfully, okay? Mm. So this makes me feel like with this person that you're dealing with, um, you might not want to make this person mad while, while when you go, okay? I do feel like this person has the ability to do things. Um, I Straight up, I'm here to ruin you, okay? So if this person may have worked with you, this person may live with you, this person may have information that can stop you or hurt you okay like somebody could just start ordering credit cards in your name or rack up a um apple bill i don't know but it's just like don't be angry don't be mean don't be rude by when telling this person to move on okay or telling this person you're gonna leave because i do feel like some retaliation is gonna come behind it okay mm. all right but other than that that's all i have for you guys make sure to check your sun moon and rising signs thanks for watching